Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Windsor Medals. I'd like to show you this lovely set of miniature medals that I've just caught mounted, put new ribbons on and cleaned the medals up really nice. A few of the medals were really tarnished, especially these ones here. Now you can see they're very, very shiny in silver and they look really nice. So basically, like I say, these are miniature medals. You would wear these on a mess function, um, a, a mess ball or a, a dining out type function. You could also wear them as a veteran in a black tie function. Um, and they're a lot easier to wear, obviously, than big medals. They're about half the size of the big medals. So it's just um, a lot, lot less awkward to wear these than big medals for uh, mess functions. So that's why they was invented in the first place. Um, so here we have basically we've got the United Nations Bosnia, which was the UNPRA for, which was protection force mandates in 1992 to 95. If you notice, it's got a, a, a numeral there, which is chrome. So the United Nation medals have chrome numerals. If you was to have numerals on the NATO medals, which are these two here, it would be a bronze colour and the numerals go up to how many tours that person that soldier served in that theater of war so obviously in this case he was there twice i have seen them i think the highest numeral i've seen is six so that means guys have uh, gone back on that particular tour six times there could be more than six if you know anybody that's done more than six let me know comment below it's interesting information for everybody so the medal next door to the uh, UNPRA 4 is the NATO former Yugoslavia issued from December 1994 to qualify for this NATO medal you had to do 30 days continuous or accumulated service next door to that medal we've got the nato kosovo medal and then next to that we've got the iraq medal 2004 which uh, it's got a clasp on this optelic medal so it's optelic one to be awarded the um, optelic medal again you have to do 30 day service continuous service or accumulated service after Optelic 1, the clasp comes off the medal. Um, so Optelic 2 onwards, it's just literally the medal with no date clasp on it. So next door to the uh, Optelic medal, the Iraq medal is the Operational Service medal, the OSM Afghanistan medal, which was uh, from 2001. And then next to that, we've got the Golden diamond and platinum jubilee medals here so the golden was 2002 the diamond was 2012 and the platinum was 2022 they look really nice together there all three of the uh, jubilee medals so on the end of the group we've got the army long service and good conduct medal so to be awarded one of these medals you have to do 15 years clear service undetected crime um, after doing the 15 years if you do a further 10 years then you'll get the clasp here so that's 25 years service there the clasps the second award bar clasps they used to be sewn on above the medal uh, but the powers to be um, in the MOD and the medal board have decided now that they've got to be sewn where the position is of this clasp, sort of halfway on the ribbon. I particularly preferred it when they was lower down, but I'm getting a bit more used to seeing them that high now on, on the medal. So it looks really nice. A really nice modern set of medals, these over the last 30 years of tours being spread out represents an amazing career for the soldier that owns these medals so anyway i just thought i'd like to share this uh, set of miniature medals with you i hope you enjoyed the video please subscribe and comment below and hit the thumbs up button thanks a lot for watching bye